so today I'm gonna go ahead and show you what I bought during Amazon Prime Day um, last week. Uh, I never got a chance to really film it because one, I was really busy, two, I had all these other packages that were coming in and I ended up filming those first. So let's go ahead and get started. So the first thing I have here is, um, these are metallic markers. So I thought that these would work well with um, the wax seals that I've been making and it turns out, no. What I actually need are more paint pens than um, colored markers. And these are water-based, so they're just not gonna work at all. I'm not gonna return it, I'm gonna go ahead and keep it. I think, let me see, how much did I get this for? Uh, I got it for pretty cheap. I think I got it for $5.99. I want to say I'm going to my orders right now you know, where are you here we are so I got that for well it's saying after tax 759 hmm yeah anyways so I purchased that I did purchase um, a resin kit so there were several of these kinds of kits that were on sale on Amazon Prime Day. Um, this one, let's see, I got this for, where are you? There you are. So this is 134 pieces and I got it for, well, after tax it came out to 1223 not bad because I was looking at some of the other ones and this one seemed like a better deal. I'm trying to see where I can open the, here it is. Cause it came with um, a lot of the stuff that I would probably have to end up buying separately, which I don't want to. Um, so I got a whole bunch of the keychains. Okay. Oh, this came out. Um, and then it came with the little thingamabob. <laughs> I don't know really know what it's called, but it looks like it's a drill bit, but it looks like it might be broken too on top of that. Anyways, this is so that you can um, drill a hole into the resin so that you can attach the keychains to. So, I don't know. Might have to buy some spare parts there. Um, and then here are the little hooks that came with it. So you can attach the keychains, and then we've got some O-rings, circle rings, whatever you want to call them. Those, and then of course the actual. Ugh. I might have to. Ugh. So much for keeping it in the back. It's like sticky. Sorry for the sound there. And then there is the um, mold with the alphabet. And it's a pretty good size. I mean, yeah, I liked it. I was afraid it was gonna be too small, but then when I got it in person, I was like, okay, this actually works out. So 12.23 for that, okay. And then I also got the ink. This right here is the alcohol ink for um, epoxy resin. So that one I got it for, and I know, you know, let's see here. I got this for after tax 1223 also. I don't remember what the um, original price was. Oh, here we go. The original price was 11, was it 11? No, I think it might've been 9.99, I'm not sure. It's not really showing it correctly on here. So yeah, so these come with 21 different colors. And um, you know, I went on Amazon Prime, not really ouch, looking to buy anything and I was just bored at work, the phone wasn't ringing. So I was looking and then I had seen, what did I see first? I saw this first, then I saw this, and then I saw the resin also on sale. So this is a 19 ounce um, resin kit here. And that one I got it for, I should have wrote these down so I wouldn't have to waste time looking it up here. I got that one for 13.97. 
not bad. I mean, um, for 19 ounces, because I was seeing that it was actually um, more expensive with like the 20 ounce, I think in the 24 ounce maybe. So, um, I'm gonna see how that one turns out. I also got um, this pack of uh, dried flowers. Okay, this was $9.99, I think. I'm not sure, um, but it was still a good deal because I got four, four packs, and this is right here, real dried pressed flowers, okay? So I got this color, these upside down, probably. <laughs> this one, this one, and this one. So I'm gonna use that with the wax seals, okay? And of course, I had to pick up more wax seals because, um, you know, if I'm going to be making a lot, I don't want to have to run out or I won't have enough to finish off. So, it's just, just the backup. It came with, it came with candles, which I don't need. I actually threw out the ones that I got in the first one because it's just a waste. They, they were kind of messed up anyways. So, it came with four candles, tea candles. Um, I did need this. This is why I picked this kit because I needed another one of the spoons. So I have a backup spoon. And this one is not as shallow as the other one. Ooh, I can hear it. Thunder. Um, and then, of course, the other kit. I think these are exactly the same colors. Man, I just noticed this one has a lot of, if you can see here, let me hold it up. These, they all look very similar. Um, I'm going to have to look for some mint colors and some more solid colors because there sure is a lot of metallic, which it's okay, but I don't really want that much metallic, you know? So yeah, this is what I got from Amazon Prime, but I also want to show something else that I had purchased um, from Amazon, which I did not show on my last Amazon haul for crafty stuff because it didn't come in until like maybe well I didn't purchase it until maybe two or three weeks after I'd shown it so what I have here are stamps and it's a one big stamp kit I believe this was like maybe $17 came with the ink but I don't care for it I have my own ink which is much better I'll get out of this box okay so these are the four stamps. Let's move this up. Okay. So I'm gonna go ahead and take them out so you can see. So let's. So we got the first one here. Focus. And they're um, actually pretty good quality, I would say. Um, you know, the rubber stamps instead of acrylic, that's why I chose it. I could have got them cheaper if I gotten the acrylic one. So, like I said, they're planner related. You can use this in any planner. Um, and then we got this one. I thought this one was really cool because it has a reading list and then a movie list, which I like. So, there you go. There's the movie list and reading. You got a tracker here. And then a weekly challenge type of thing. And then a regular calendar. This is great for bullet journaling. Unfortunately, I don't do bullet journaling because it takes too much damn time, which I don't want to waste <laughs> on. I just want to just open it up and just put in what I got to put in. I don't want to have to take the time to like draw everything out and basically just make everything from scratch. So then we got the regular like calendar one here mostly weekly you know and then this last one here it's more of a, like a checklist kind of thing and then you've got your like I guess I don't know what you want to call it like a timer of some type and then you know some grid here so yeah these are all the things that I got from um, Amazon Prime with the exception of this right here but this is actually actually the first time that I've actually purchased a lot of stuff from Amazon Prime Day. Because um, normally there wasn't really a lot. I was only looking at electronic stuff and I really didn't find anything that I thought that was 
worth it last year I think the only thing I bought was like a pair of um, wireless earbuds but this year I fell down the rabbit hole when I started looking at the craft stuff and there was just more you know to choose from this year so yeah did you guys purchase anything from Amazon Prime Day and if you did let me know what you got all right so have a great week bye